YouTube, this is Supercharged iOS, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys one of my favorite launchers. It's called the Windows 8 launcher, and it looks, if you're familiar, I'm sure you are, with the Windows Phone and Windows 8, it looks a lot like it. It's basically the same launcher that you would have on the Windows Phone, just running through the OUYA. Now, I'll go ahead and put a link in the description so that you can uh, download the application, the Android APK. And basically what you do is you go through the list. All you have to do as with any other launcher, you just press your OUYA button once and you can see across the bottom right there, several different options. You go into preferences. First thing you want to do is go to layout, screen orientation, and change that right there from portrait to tablet to landscape because you don't want your screen to change from portrait you want it, I mean you don't want it to go into portrait you want it to stay in landscape so that you will have the full screen effect so if you go back into your preferences you can see there are several other settings you can configure your live weather you can configure your gmail it's very cool your twitter all this good stuff so it's an excellent launcher like I said the link will be in the description this is one of my favorites between this one and the iPad one I'd say this one's a little better the iPad one is rather simple this one actually has news story tickers live and live weather and so much more stuff that you can do and you can do several other things like you can resize your icons right here I'll go ahead and move them down two sizes you see so depending on how far you sit from your television or just if you prefer them smaller or larger I like to sit a good distance from my TV so I like the larger icons and when you press again when you press the OUYA sync remote button you can go and go through to your color right here and you can choose different color themes I have it on green right now. I'll go ahead and change it back to the blue that looks closer to the standard Windows theme. So again, it's pretty cool looking. Now, if you want to change any of these icons, whenever you'll have a bunch of question marks, blank icons, all you have to do is click on each one, and it'll give you the option to go ahead and add whichever application you'd like to launch. All right, so tell me what you think in the comment section below. Is the Windows launcher your favorite? Do you like the iPad better? Let me know. This is Supercharged iOS. Like us at Facebook.com forward slash Charged iOS. Follow us at Twitter.com forward slash Charged iOS. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.